TAKEOVER! Berlin, was geht ab? Yeah! Ich fange mal auf Deutsch an. Wie viele Russen gibt's hier heute? Yeah! Wie viele Juden gibt's hier heute? Yeah! Wie viele Araber gibt's hier heute? Wie viele Deutsche gibt's hier heute? Yeah! Wie viele Battle Rap Fans gibt's hier heute? Yeah! Now, thanks for welcoming me, I must switch to English. Tonight, top tier takeover, make some fucking noise! Yeah! My voice is gone, it doesn't matter. Let me introduce the first MC of this amazing, amazing battle. He comes from Düsseldorf, he is Mr. Respektlos. He is one of the most amazing MCs in Germany, the most viewed, Sönig! Yo, 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 yo. Without any further ado, let me introduce the second MC tonight. You know him. He's the original traveling MC. One of the best in the world to do it. A guy that I just battled in Los Angeles. He is incredible. He has done this in many countries across the world. A true beast. Disaster! Okay, also, alle bitte ruhig, wir fangen an. Tsch. Erste Runde. Cynic. So, Ruhe. Ready? I'm ready, bro. Right now I'm like, finally. Disaster spending time with me. <laughs> Two and a half years ago, you was battling Tierster. And now he thinks, another black guy from Germany? This is disturbing me. But I am not Tierster. Unless you think I had a makeover, lost 60 pounds and went to university. <laughs> <laughs> nah, man, I'm sick. I'm Germany's most viewed. Just like you in the States. So whether I do stand-up comedy or not, I gotta be one of the greats. So look me into my four eyes <laughs> and tell me you ain't scared as shit. Because right now, I am clean. You stoned. I brush my teeth. You don't. <laughs> okay. But all kidding the side up and Watching his battle since 2011 with his raging moves and now I'm on the same stage as you. This is amazing, dude. This was my big wish and I'm not here to win this. Actually, it already feels like king shit just to be in this. And all that because I took care of my better rap business. Hard work, dedication. I believed in myself. And no other good German better rapper speaks English. <laughs> so, so. Two and a half years ago, I took a picture with you. Flash, lightning, now you're my opponent. Man, damn, that's frightening. But it's not frightening because you're a good battle rapper. It's frightening because he punched a guy in the face. In a battle. Because the other guy said, do it. <laughs> do it. Really? That makes you mad? Just do it? <laughs> that, that makes you snap? Just do it? Right now the Nike store at Kudam is ruined because he saw their slogan on the window and punched right through it. <laughs> nah, but you're a nice dude. I know that now, but if you would live in Berlin, mm -hmm. in that town, mm -hmm. with that face, you can never adapt. How? All you can do, besides act foul, is making a mean face and carry a baseball bat in a hip-hop video background. <laughs> <laughs> 
So in LA, you might be a big shot, running around like, suck it, fuck it. But in Germany, you are just a Kanake. <laughs> Hey, listen, listen. Nobody's scared. Hey, nobody's scared of your punchlines, metaphors, similes, or hooks. It's just your looks. But one day with a Großfamilie, and you don't make a mux. <laughs> speaking of, speaking of, don't making it. You're a soccer fan, right? Speaking of, speaking of, yeah, football. Speaking of, don't making it. The U.S. American soccer team didn't qualify for the World Cup next year. And I feel, really, I feel really sorry for the American soccer fans because them not being able to go is not just. American fans have to be in the stadium. They always want to party. They're always ready to bust. Americans have to be there. It's a must. You get me? It's a must because without the U.S., it's just empty. Oh. Nice one. We're playing. We're playing. I got some around the corner bus for you, ass. So you probably think I'm a geek who never studies for his tests, but he instantly passes. But I'm a killer, and I'm a killer who finishes rappers. Better was, we didn't attend similar classes. You a wimp. You a wigger that spazzes. You think I'm a weak nigga? But I'm a 6'3 nigga with glasses who single-handedly who. But I'm a 6'3 nigga with glasses who single-handedly disses and smashes all the different faggots with lyrical acid. So listen, this, this is my message. Ich bin respektlos. Einer, einer geht. I'm gonna fuck your mother while she's at the tattoo studio. This is my way to finish this year. At first, she's cool, laying in a stool, waiting for the tattoo, sipping a beer, but that turns real quick into fear. Because when I'm getting too near, she's fitting my spear, and I'm drilling her ear. And after I'm done splitting her ear, I'm going to tattoo her pussy. And she's shedding a tear. And you know what I write? Just to make it simple and clear, zzz, Cynic was here. OK. Time! Make some noise for the first round of disaster! Now, Cynic was first here. First round on disaster. Let me go, man. Cynic was here. Then I came right after it and crossed it out and said, Cynic's a queer. <laughs> Fucking. Yo, seriously, though, you caught me off guard. Those raps were hot. Yo, I should really give this faggot some props. Not because he was nice, but I didn't know giraffes could talk. <laughs> no, and I'm not saying giraffe because you're tall and you got hooves like one. I'm saying giraffe because you fucking look like one. <laughs> but anyhow, enough of the jokes. Cynic, nice to finally meet you. I know there's a language barrier between us, so I'm gonna slow it down so you understand who you're trying to speak to. Today, I'm gonna beat you. <laughs> Fucking, his name is Cynic. That's fucking horrific. How the fuck did you get it? I fucked up my phone like 27 times just trying to spell it. Every time I hit the fucking send message, I mixed up all the letters together and the phone would just autocorrect it and I fidget with it and I took my phone and just kicked it off and this is like, fuck this shit. Then his sister picked it up and looked at all my dick pics. Cynic. He drives a hybrid Civic. <laughs> it was denied by exhibit. <laughs> he's in a relationship, y'all. I understand he's fully committed. When Shaggy said it wasn't me, yeah. he was the guy that did it. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking cynic. In the rain, dancing to push it to the limit. His favorite rapper of all time still is Skrillex. I'm just playing, man. You're gonna kill it. You must be high up some coke. You think these people over here care about your life, but they don't. 
Man, no one over here takes you serious or cares what you online trying to promote. I know it hurts inside because I'm a successful actor and a successful rapper and you dying to be both. See, the problem is you think they your guys. They just disguised as your folks because you what? Get millions of views online and you still rhyming and broke. So being a comedian fits you because your whole fucking life is a joke. You understand me? Now that we're here, I must really confess, it was hard to recognize you without the wig and the dress. <laughs> He's smiling through his teeth. His whole fucking squad is weak. Man, you look like what he did when he was trying to be a transvestite. <laughs> Yo, 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 yo. Oh man, this is funny to me. <laughs> this is funny to me, man. I can see him dressed up in pink. <laughs> and he's a bartender. What the fuck did you think? What are you still standing here for, bro? Go get me a drink! <laughs> Jägermeister! <laughs> Rhyme too sick when I run up with my bazooka. Everybody knows from Russia that I'm a shooter. Last night we was doing a poo 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 pushka. I heard you lived in Spain. Coño la madre, hijo de puta. You wanna go to Lebanon? Ain't it I'll take kill a kiss and make a hush or muta. Even my, even my baby I could just was it. I'm a kenit maftuha. The homie from Stop Rosa is from Poland. He told me you're a kurva. And my homie, hold up, hold on. And Oxy is in the building. Bliatsuka is fik dynamuta. Bitch ass motherfucker. Ain't fucking with me. Ain't never gonna fuck with me, man. Now you could go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was supposed to be two minutes, remember? Okay, no. make some nice one, disaster! Yeah! Second round on Cynic, let's go. Now let's we go. got both mothers fucked, we got that out of the way? <laughs> we can move on. Okay. So, someone told you I was on TV dressed like a woman and looking like a transvestite? That's nice. <laughs> Uh, a black guy on TV with a dress, yikes. But speaking of that, shout outs to LeBron James, Jamie Foxx, Eddie Murphy and Wesley Snipes. Listen, I am not from Berlin. I am from motherfucking deep town. You hear that? Almost nobody knows what the fuck I even mean now. <laughs> but, right. you're, but you're from LA, right? Yes. <laughs> you ever heard of Düsseldorf, huh? <laughs> Düsseldorf! Yellow and black. Düsseldorf, <laughs> fuck face. <laughs> because in Düsseldorf, everyone is into fashion, motherfucker. <laughs> it's a grown man's passion to be running around like some faggot, motherfucker. <laughs> We are proud of our art galleries. That's what's happening, motherfucker. Right now, I am talking to you because I'm not good at rapping, motherfucker. He's doing his thing. But all that money and cars and Dusseldorf people being stuck up, that's not me, motherfucker, because I was raised in the hood. <laughs> Dusseldorf Bilk. <laughs> And man, it wasn't nice out there. No jobs, no nine to five out there. Baby mamas by themselves, always about to cry out there. It was drama. Man, I had to fight out there. One time, I wanted to walk across the street at night out there, standing, waiting for the green light out there. Waiting, standing, waiting for the green light out there. But it was red. <laughs> so I looked to the left, I went, a car came from the right. Man, I almost died out there. <laughs> so you tell me, 
So you tell me I couldn't last one day on your block in LA's effing streets. Well, you couldn't last one day on my block because it's too clean and nobody sells weed. <laughs> you know what I heard? You know what I heard? I heard in LA, pit bulls turn into pussies when it comes to the bloods and the cribs. Well, in Düsseldorf, pit bulls turn into pussies when it comes to Abro Spritz. <laughs> now, as you can tell, now as you can all, now as you can all see and tell, I'm a different kind of black man because I eat chicken wings with a fork. I'm a different kind of black man because I eat chicken wings with a fork. Indeed, and a knife. I'm a different kind of black man because I would never cheat on my wife. I'm a different kind of black man because I get furious when I have an appointment and she or he is not on time. I'm a different kind of black man because I never smoked weed with you, right? So fuck you and your meaningful black stereotypes. I'm the most German nigga you ever seen in your life. Yo. Yo. Hey, wait, I'm not done. I'm not done. Oh. Don't listen to the fat guy. Don't listen to the fat guy. Four minutes. Four minutes. You stop complaining. You remind me of Kim Kardashian. I know it's not obvious, but I want everyone to see because both of them embarrassed themselves on reality TV. Reality TV. I would never do that. <laughs> But you re recognize the way he raps is always so, so mean and just hateful. But what nobody in here knows, this guy, Disaster, can sing like an angel. <laughs> R&B, that's the schönste Stimme. Ladies, ladies, it's gonna break your heart, but it's too late. But before a woman comes up to his apartment for a date, he is still in battle mode. Like, yeah, I'm Disaster, I got a date. <laughs> so, if, so if the bitch comes knocking, I go right in the fuck. Yeah, I'm gonna tear that pussy up. Be careful, man. Fuck that shit. I'm gonna bust it up. That's it. Titty, fuck that bitch. I'm gonna smack her ass if that's a fire to just bust the night. I'm gonna swing my dick from left to right like ping pong. Yeah, ding dong. It's so funny running after you. You know, you know that song, right? That's, that's a really nice song. So you may continue with your multi-syllable yapping and have fun with a crowd that knows that you're better at singing than rapping. Time, okay. Make some noise for, make some noise for Sydney! Nice! Now, second round, disaster. Oh man. I'ma make your bitch suck my dick. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'ma make a lick my boss. Standing on the corner again. She told you that we was just friends. No, no. It's easy. And you bringing that up just clearly shows the coward in them. Especially the four eyes. Those really show the coward in them. This is his rap costume. He's proud he's in them. Oh, oh, his glasses are like his sword. They, it's really empowering them. His mom was like, I know. He even takes a shower in them. Yo, little fool, ever since middle school, he was having his glasses on while he was swimming in the swimming pool, little fucking maggot. This was a major fail, because your frame is frail. You got a face that says, I got raped in jail. <laughs> it says gay on his grill when blind people read his face in braille. Pause. Beta Pause. male. Pause. Wants to graduate from Yale. Just ate some kale. Wears wigs and paints his nails. <laughs> <laughs> Body type, cocaine rail. 
no brain off the Kurt Cobain scale. I done moved through snow, rain, and hell to get cats. But I know there's a language barrier, so I held back and set up these premeditated death traps so I could excel where he prevails at. Are you kidding me? I represent liberty, you get your bell cracked. Hell well, that's just a pet slap. You sitting here telling jokes, you running in circles. You said I was gonna call you Urkel, but you the one that called yourself that. Have some confidence in yourself, Urkel. What? It's 2018 almost. You think that's the level I'm currently at? First of all, all my Germans know if I'm gonna pick somebody, it's gonna be a way better nerd than that. Cause Urkel's just a nerd. You're a nerd that raps. You softer than Pee Wee Herman's cat. And I don't even know if Pee Wee Herman has a cat. You a battle rap punching bag. Punched and slapped, lunch jacked. Underwear pulled up to his butt crack. Not cause you're skinny and black, cause you're a fucking comedian and you love that. Your life is a fucking joke. I told you last time, feminine, look like a lesbian senator, body build and image like a fucking video game editor. You look like the type of guy that would take a bitch on a romantic date just so you can have a place to sit down and lecture her. <laughs> or try to Bruce Jenner her. <laughs> Why the fuck do these rappers accept this? Cause all you battle rappers have a death wish. And I stand corrected if he gets the best of me, but damn, I'm selfish. Ain't nothing left of me but Hell's Kitchen. I'm serving shellfish. Yeah, get your head and neck disconnected like Kevin Spacey from Seven. Your head to get boxed in the desert if you step, bitch. Man, they ain't even get this. <laughs> Yo, they ain't even get this. Too sick, now I left off, so I have to get it back. Watch how I wreck this, test this, move, I'ma hit the red switch. Your ankles get both snapped and your leg rips. I have your leg look like one of those L bricks in Tetris. Yeah, you stupid ass bitch. Look, hold on, yo. Yo, I have them looking like one of those L bricks in Tetris. If you even attempt this, then I'll finish you off with an original cross like a Jesuit. Yeah, I seen your fucking comedy clips. And yeah, you guessed this shit. The only thing I want to see more of it is less of it. <laughs> I, I'm, <laughs> I'm not impressed with how, I'm not impressed with this, all these subliminal messages and how he stretches his sentences and how he tries to go down to the essence, but hip hop is a real art form and being a comedian just it isn't an element. You just fucked up in the wrong game now, huh? But me and you are very alike. Except you rebuttaled some shit I didn't even say. Where were the black stereotypes? Where were they? What, you think I'm some type of white Aryan? Where you're a fucking angry, nice librarian. <laughs> but on a downside you, on a downside you are a fictitious rebel. Living in a world where everybody try to downsize you but you walk the street in big stilettos cause nobody can walk the town like you, hold on. <laughs> no one can walk the town like you, get hit with twisted metal cause you roll with a clown type crew. Listen bro, I'm a real American. Ain't nobody can know what these rounds might do. I know Arnold Schwarzenegger ain't German, but fuck him too cause he sounds like you. <laughs> Yo. We were supposed to go two minutes and he was supposed to finish this. Now he went four minutes. This shit is fucking ridiculous. I'm battling two of you right now so I get to fuck up both of you idiots. Lame ass. Fucking bitch. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah. Time? Yeah, that's good. Okay, make some noise for disaster. Okay. So, last round, Cynic. Nice one, nice one. <laughs> But all that, <laughs> stop that. <laughs> you sound like a pothead who enjoys watching reruns of Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> you were born in Lebanon. No? Okay, but you experienced the civil war in Lebanon. But you represent the USA, that's a fact. You're lucky because I don't know shit about politics and I got nothing more to say about that. Clearly. 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 Thank you. Somebody tell him it's something. Respect. Huh? 
But what I know is the USA wants to build a wall to separate themselves from Mexico. <laughs> a wall. We did that 60 years ago. <laughs> it's not a big deal. It's more like itty bitty. That's not nice. Dude, that's shitty. Germans only respect walls if they are right through the city. <laughs> So the only thing you should do right now is your eyebrows. Not for Augenbrauner. Because when I come too close, they might push me. Even porn stars from the 70s are like, this is way too bushy. <laughs> and doesn't he, imagine this, doesn't he look like a guy who could have worked outside here at Schlesisches Tor years ago, preparing kebab, shawarma, falafel, and more? But he hated his job. Every time he came to the store, he was stomping the floor, screaming, I can't take this no more, running outside of the door. Then he goes back to the USA. He goes to the gym. He drinks raw eggs out of glasses, puts needles in his ass, and he spazzes, getting aggressive. Anabolica, mm, steroids, day and night at the gym. Then he comes back to the BNU and screams, I'm in Berlin! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, my grandfather, my German grandfather, is 94, and he fought for the Nazis. No, 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 it was. He fought for the Nazis in the Second World War. He had loads of concussions. He called me before the battle and sounded like he was disappointed or something. He was like, Samuel, no shit, as if the toilet is flushing. Don't be too mean to disaster, even though he's annoying and cussing. I have mid-light mid-disaster. Because, because he lost to Oxymiron from the Soviet Union, no debate. <laughs> Because he lost to Oxymiron from the Soviet Union, no debate or discussion. I was in Stalingrad, so I know how it feels to be raped by a Russian. Who are you talking to? Who are you talking to? My grandfather. You lost to a Vitaly, a Vladimir, a Yuri. You lost to a Yuri. But it was your Yuri's diction to be superior class. And even though Yuri's diction wasn't inferior trash, Yuri's dick shouldn't have been in your ass. <laughs> so don't make such a mean face. And don't hate on Mook because he rhymes cheesecake with me steak. You're just jealous because he does bigger movies and music these days. You rap for how many years? You rap for how many years? He said the same thing. Where's your music, Bashir? Your whole music career is a cheat day. When is your next album's release date? You want me to keep asking questions? Because I can. As long as you don't put out any music, no, you're not more of a rapper than I am. Which is practically nothing. And you know that's right. German and American hip-hop producers unitedly say, battle rappers cannot make dope tracks in the studio. Yeah, wegen dir und Greg Pipe, du Hurensohn! <lacht> okay, macht Lärm für Cine! Super! Yo! Letzte Runde, die Sasse! Alright, first off, before we go any further, that rape by Russian shit, I'm gonna have to rebutter that punchline. Because you said your grandfather said that to you. So technically, you got raped through your bloodline. <laughs> I'm doing it again. Fuck what this chump said. I'll beat his ass even if I sound like Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking weirdo. God damn, you're weird. One look on your face, I can tell you haven't had a girl in a year. Fucking lame ass. If these cats bluffing, then we back hunting. And I'm past bluffing. Your bitch is in for a serious ass fucking. She getting her ass plucked in the back of a lack with the band drum. And I feel like I'm inside my own head and Alice in Wonderland is in the back running because I can't tell what this cat's puffing. I said this is like Al Bundy swag, no cash money like Baby and Wayne when they're bad blooding. If it's beef, then it's hand-to-hand -hand combat, no gap busting. I'm trying to, trying to grab something you can use for slab cutting and stab something. 
grab chair, start uses shank. Have you hooked up to a machine with the same mask and tube you would use for a scuba tank? Hoogan zoom, pull out the Hoogan zoom and Luger, then I shoot his face. Fuck you, yo. <laughs> yo. Hoogan zoom and I shoot your face. <laughs> Lame ass. <laughs> about to spaz on him like I did the A class. Cause the rap is all tight, man. The reason why I'm fucking up right now is cause we just came from Kevin. We was rocking a fucking concert and I was rapping all night. Tell me I don't have songs. How the fuck are we equal? I don't have songs. We just did two songs together in front of 10,000 people. You lame fuck. Real talk. You can't fuck with me, I'm an animal. Flow too sick, I open up your fucking cantaloupe. Open up your can like a Hannibal, you know I'm a cannibal. Fuck around with me, I'ma take the shit from digital to analog, from automatic to manual. Fuck around and treat you like one of my cockroach spaniels. Fucking around and I shoot you in the face. Playing a banjo, tango, letting the thing go. Fuck around and take your heart out like Kano. Get your bitch knocked in the ass like J-Lo. When I say so, give me your fucking head like a potato. I'm disaster, I'm a hurricane, I'm a natural tornado. A fucking volcano blowing up in your face, make you Hool it now, hool it down. Make your fucking waves come out the volcano to make the rock cool it down. Fuck around with me, I school you clowns. Who's gonna play with this? Nothing you can say to this. They said they don't believe in me. You must be an atheist. I let you go four minutes, you punk ass bitch, and I freestyle, still whip your little fucking bitch ass quick. Yeah. Yeah. Too sick for you. Yeah. You know it's off the principle. Know what I'ma do to you. Fuck around with me, I'ma show you how you go to your own funeral. It's so fucking beautiful. He's the type of little nerd that'll be sitting down, typing in little numbers on his cubicle, playing games with me. You know I'm about to rip this. Told you this is a disaster, the sickest motherfucker you've ever witnessed. Bitch, you don't handle no fucking business, and let me tell you how it goes down. Ich verstehe Wagen nicht. You can fucking swallow dick. Hey, yo, hold on. Stop this shit. Ich verstehe Wagen nicht. You need to fucking stop this shit. Cause you would fucking suck Hollow's dick. For a special LOMT, you would lick the balls and all that shit. So since you love Hollow that much and that's my homie, and you wanna be on that level, I got you something in this bag. It's really fucking special. Now you're probably thinking I'm gonna do a punchline because I'm an asshole, so I would do something stupid. But since I like Cynic and I actually fuck with him, I got him an LOM sweatshirt that's actually exclusive. And this is from me to you before I end on this high shit. Thank you, bro. Go ahead. Psych, I lied, this is my shit. You fucking feel what you mean. Yo, this is my shit. Make some noise for this battle! Make noise for Sinning and Disaster! What? Mustard! Yeah, I just want to say. Thank you for fucking rocking with us, man. This is the end of my fucking, like, my European tour thing that I set up, and I've been out here in Europe for, like, two weeks. I just want to say, ending it on the snow after being with Oxy and Kiev and just seeing the European hip-hop, man. The graffiti, the tattoos, the hip-hop over here, the battle rap, man. I love you, motherfuckers. Thank you for hanging with me, because I don't know how I'm still talking right now. Standing on my feet! Let's fucking go! I'm just surviving off this real energy right now. All these fucking real hip hop. That's what I'm running on. And a few words. Top tier takeover. Respect für all die Leute, die das organisiert haben. Tier Star und die ganze Crew. Danke, danke, danke. Das war top, top, top. Wir danken euch. Ich hoffe, wir bleiben noch am Start. When I say top tier, you say take over. Top tier, top tier. When I say top tier, you say take over. Top tier, top tier. Top Tier T.
Takeover Version 2.0. System wird geladen. Das beste deutsche Rap Battle Lineup der Geschichte wird gesucht. Daten werden gesammelt. Daten werden analysiert. Rapper wurden lokalisiert. Es treten an. Jizzy gegen Fresh Polacke. Clap gegen Finch Asozial. Cynic gegen Greg Pipe. Mighty Moo gegen Damien Davis. Pat Stay gegen Tierstar Andres. Am 31.03.2018. Veranstaltungsort Astra lokalisiert. Update. Das Astra Kulturhaus in Berlin. Zugangsdaten auf dem Tickets.de Server gesichtet.